Are you the new attendant here? Because I think I got a quarter if you want to do my windshield. Oh, yeah. I remember your predictions. Well, I'm still on the city's payroll. Those psychic hotlines, I hope they're not uh, one of your rackets. Do you have authorization to tell me, detective? You said anything about tailing? Oh, I see. You just kind of, like, hang out here, and when it gets dark, you come out like a, like a bat? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's good. What about you? You checking into the hotel? I got more probable cause to be here than you have to stop me. They still teach that at the academy? Probable cause? Or did you have the flu that day? <clears throat> Uh-oh. That's your excuse? Write me a ticket. You know, you wouldn't believe how many killers, rapists, pimps, drug dealers Peddlers of kitty porn are apprehended because they double parked in a traffic cop, searched their car. When it comes to car searches, oh. you see, I was the head of my class. You saw how I tossed your place after you OD'd? That's nothing compared to what I can do to a digitized dashboard instrument panel and a custom leather interior. Excuse me. Your drug-sniffing poodles Already went over it, remember? Would you like me to take you in instead? Security, please. This is the operator. How may I help you? Yes, can I have security, please? Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Uh, I'm sorry, operator. I forgot to dial nine first. <laughs> That's quite all right, sir. Have a good evening. Who's there? Hello?
are a glutton for punishment. By some miracle, you managed to hold on to your badge. And here you are threatening me with false arrest again. You said anything about arrest? I could still take you in for questioning. You're off the case now. The Catherine Bell shooting, Luke Spencer and the undead, that's all off limits to you now. What about the circumstances surrounding your OD? Have you ever thought about questioning somebody who was conscious at the time? And what about the bit about slashing up my limo if I said no? Which I am tempted to do just to watch Scorpio sign the check to get it fixed. Do I have to train every cop on this police force myself? Not to worry. <laughs> I've had lessons. I need to give my men a little reassurance. I knew this. Either he's a hired man for one of those heroin honchos, and he's tracking Brenda, or he's a man on a mission, and the mission is me. So the only way I'm going to find out is if I go with him. You get me Valentine, just in case our friend gets carried away again. You understand what I'm saying, Joseph? Mm hmm? I'm all yours, detective. Okay. Oh. This was his free consent, in case anybody asks. No, Sonny. What? Brandis? Mm-hmm. I'll be right back. Okay. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. I've heard that before. I gotta return something. There's, uh, there's nobody here. What's that sound? Oh, it's, uh, music. Oh, no, 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 the other sound. The, the phone was dead. It's picking up a signal of the uh, kind that jams cell phones. Oh, <laughs> I couldn't even find my cell phone. That's okay, I got one. Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> How'd you do that? Close the door. Oh, my. Stop. Lock it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and let me have that before you hurt yourself. <laughs> Where's Sonny? Did he send you? I don't work for Sonny anymore. Oh, what do you mean? What you forgot, just like him. Lily died. No, no one forgot. No. No, it, it almost killed Sonny. Almost is only good in horseshoes. You know, Harry, that Sonny was there when it happened and he saw the whole thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, he'll, he'll have to carry that with him for the rest of his life. Yeah. And what's this? You stupid, wire-wearing, lying little whore. Because he watched the wrong person die. And I'm gonna make it so he gets it right this time. If that's Sonny, ask him in. Take your coat off. I won't be here that long. So, you want to know what about what, Detective? Well, I thought we were going to wait for your boys to fetch your attorney. Wouldn't want to violate your rights. Where you from, Detective, originally? Well, I, um, I remember a woman. She was large, warm, and I called her mummy. Yeah. And she made you watch The King and I one too many times. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're cruel. You don't have anything, do you, detective? Not 
the heroin suppliers, not Marilyn Cooper's body. Only thing you got on your mind is staring deep into my eyes. Funny thing about corpses after this length of time, they come easy to misidentify. For instance, the two we found at the Rochester fire. That's not your case. Who were they? Where'd they come from? Do you not get that one word from me and Valentine will sue you for your socks, your shoes, your car, your pension, your department's donut budget for the next 50 years? It's, 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 a, it's, it's a rare and many splendid thing, stupidity like yours. And, I'm, and I mean that in the most respectful possible way. Mm -hmm. Hi, Joseph. You left this. Oh, yeah, I was looking for that. Yeah, the security guys in the lobby made me open it. Oh, your cellular fell out. Oh, thanks. Everything okay? Oh, yeah. I'm just, uh... I just, I was taking a nap. He scared me. Now, Sonny would have come up himself, but... Anything you want me to tell him? Uh... Just... Tell him to stay the hell away from me. Over there. Sit down. You heard what he said. There's security guys everywhere on this floor. Well, I didn't have too much of a problem getting in and out, did I? Just as well as it wasn't sunny. For that, I want fireworks. My husband's gonna be here next. No, oh, well, he's with his ex. How does it feel like to be cheated on instead of one of the cheaters? You know, Harry, Sonny never cheated on Lily. How stupid did you think I was? You were around every corner waiting to lie down with him. You're right. I was. But Sonny wouldn't have me. He and Lily were solid. Their marriage was solid. And I'm happily married now. You're just imagining something, Harry, that's, that's not there between us anymore. What? You think I don't know different from Sonny's own mouth? Lily's not too solid now, is she? She's, she's, yeah, she's an angel, like she was in this life, like, like, like the baby she was gonna have. Look, if you want to last another hour, don't get me started. Harry, what good is killing me gonna do? You? None. You don't matter. You're trash. But Sonny's gotta learn. I tried very hard to teach him all the important things, but the one about who he owes honor, loyalty, trust, that one he never got. Well, maybe seeing the life get blown out of you will educate him. Sit down. Right. Pick up the pen and write what I say. No. Pick up the pen. You think I'm gonna help you, Harry? I'm just gonna end up dying anyway, right? So why would I help you bring Sonny here so you can kill him too? Who knows? I might screw up. Do you know that Sonny loved you like a father? And I loved him like a son. And Lily like a daughter. Well, a man's gotta do what his daughter can't do for herself. Honey. Lily would never want you to do this. This is not for Sonny, okay? Did you ever write a Dear John letter? I'm sorry it was nice while it lasted, You want me to write a letter to Jackson? No, we don't that... have enough time. Pick up the pen. You want me to say that I'm leaving Jackson a letter? He'll never believe that. Oh, I think he might. He won't. Harry, he'll know something's wrong. Pick up the pen. No. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Dear Jax, 